zaidi ya wajumbe wapya arobaini wakiwemo mabalozi wakuu wa mabalozi wajumbe pamoja na manaibu wa mabalozi walikutana kwenye makao rasmi ya naibu rais Rigathi Gashagwa katika mtaa wa Karen jijini Nairobi naibu rais akitoa changamoto kwa mabalozi wapya kuangazia uongezaji wa masoko zaidi ya mauzo ya mazao ya Kenya wa coffee wa tea wa milk wa meat wa avocado wa mira and let us get our space in the world market we therefore request you to really take time to think through what are the opportunities available in the country you are going to serve for the Kenyan people aliwataka mabalozi hao kuzingatia swala la kupanua nafasi za kibiashara ili kuimarisha uwekezaji wa moja kwa moja bali na kuafikia mikataba makubaliano kuhusu masuala ya leba ili kubuni nafasi zaidi za ajira kwa wakenya katika nchi za kigeni we have 6 million unemployed people young people in this country and i'm sure if you guys put your might to it in the proper way there is great and huge opportunity for our people to get employment opportunities and you create good frameworks so that these people are treated with dignity and they are not exploited waziri mwenye mamlaka makuu ambaye pia ni waziri wa mashauri ya nchi za kigeni Musalia Mudavadi aliyekuepo kwenye kikao hicho pia alisema Kenya ni kivutio kikubwa duniani na kwamba mabalozi hao wanafaa kutumia fursa hiyo kwa manufaa ya kiuchumi nations are beginning to use different tools to broaden their influence to broaden their footprint and clearly the economic angle is becoming a very strong tool Viongozi wengine walohudhuria mkutano huo ni pamoja na waziri wa utalii Dr. Alfred Mutua, mwanzake wa ustawi wa vyama vya ushirika Simon Chelugui, katibu katika baraza la mawaziri Masi Wanjau, katibu katika wizara ya mashauri ya nchi za kigeni Dr. Corrid Singoei, na katibu katika idara ya maslahi ya wakenya wanaoishi nchi za kigeni Roslyn Jogu. We produce 1.2 million graduates yearly. Out of that 800,000 are absorbed by our economy. So it means we have 400 Kenyans who have no jobs. Kenya should be recording realistically with what we have God has given us 78 million tourists coming to our country. But that's the trajectory we are going to. When people say we want to hit 2 million mark, 2 million is nothing in those. So we'll be counting on you in terms of really working with us together. Kamchimenza Darubini.